Hello everybody, Kimosabi here, coming at you with another video. So this one's off of the Takeout webpage, a write-up by Gwen Inhanat, published on February 1st, 2019, at 9.52am. With the topic of, Gerharaldali and Russell Stover find $750,000 for excessive candy packaging. There's nothing worse than tearing into that box of Russell Stover's you got for Valentine's Day, only to fight through all the brown paper to finally get to your favorite nuggets and caramels. If it seemed to you like there was a lot of paper in there, congrats, you were right. Fox Business reports that Stover's and Gorel Deli, both owned by Swiss chocolate maker Lindit and Sprugel, were sued and fined $750,000 for alleg allegedly packaging chocolates in oversized packaging to deceive consumers into thinking they were purchasing more chocolate than they were actually receiving, says Fox Business. The lawsuit alleged that the companies were misleading customers by selling chocolate products in oversized containers that were predominantly empty. Gerardelli was also dinged for selling a product that contained less cacao than advertised. Without admitting any wrongdoing, the companies agreed to a $750,000 fine. They also agreed to revisit their packaging practices, which could include shrinking boxes to more accurately reflect the amount of candy inside, or perhaps offering transparent box windows to add to aid the consumers. Previous lawsuits went under candy makers Nestle and Rothers after consumers reportedly purchased a near-empty resin and nets box and half empty bag of caramels respectively candy buyers beware and maybe give that box or bag a good shake before purchase hopefully you enjoyed the write-up everybody kimo sabe out we'll see you in the next one thanks everybody bye